Hula. Benaka. <laughs> now, one of the best parts about being on holiday is getting to indulge in some fine dining. And here at Treasure Island in Fiji, they have plenty of different dining options to choose from. So you might have to make a meal itinerary just to try everything. If you don't know where to start, the main restaurant is always a good decision to help ease you into things. If you're on a seaside holiday, it's almost a ritual to enjoy a seafood meal or two. With thanks to the La Mecana restaurant, you can feast on the very best seafood that the South Pacific has to offer. When you're looking for a quiet bite to eat during the day, make your way to the Waitui Grill. Here you can enjoy a light meal without having to leave your pool lounge for too long. Just because you're in the South Pacific doesn't mean you're limited to the local cuisine. For a little bit of theatrics, pull up a seat at the Matasawa Teppanyaki, where you can watch your meals be skillfully prepared right before your eyes. If you can't seem to leave the beach, then not to worry, because when the sun sets, your dinner can come to you. The seaside barbecue is perfect for those who want to enjoy a relaxing meal just metres from the ocean. To top it off, you'll have your own private chef to prepare your meal. For those who are visiting Treasure Island for a special occasion, be sure to consider the Sunset Bureaus for one of your meals. Now, I don't know about you, but Treasure Island in Fiji is definitely one island that I wouldn't mind being stuck on. With everything you could possibly need right here, the only thing missing is you.